Yes, yes, how's everyone doing? UK Master Kush. Just up at the office now, checking on the Exodus cheese from Real Gorilla Seeds. End of week two. Week two, day two actually to be precise. As you can see from the last update, they have definitely grown and shunted up a wee bit. Probably about a third or fourth node, all of them. Uh, obviously, we've still got the little water flowers here. CBD, pink kush from Seedsman, white widows, and that one is, I can't remember, we're going to have to go and check. But we're going to jump in and have a closer look. Uh, well, start it. Give them, a, give them a foliar feed on the old uh, BioTabs organic boom boom spray. This shit fucking rocks, man. I got sent it last year and uh, by BioTabs and it won a span of his cup this uh, last year or this year, I can't remember. Everyone raves about it and I've only got great things to say. I haven't got the technical information, i.e. ingredients, but it's full of organic greatness. Mix it up, make sure you use it within 12 hours, otherwise it starts fermenting and it absolutely stinks, man. I made that mistake the first time I used it, yeah. So anyway, we're gonna go in there, give it a, give it a fully feed of Boom Boom spray. And uh, yeah, because they're still on there first initial watering, their first initial feed, balanced pH water, they just, the soil was pretty moist so they've just been running off the moisture that was in the soil once we transplanted them and it's enriched with seaweed anyway so you've got all that extra nitrogen boost in there, natural seaweed um, and it seems to be, they seem to be loving it, no issues whatsoever with the soil, obviously with the clay pebble and the perlite, a layer of pebble at the bottom seeing that one there, yeah. That's going to help with the uptake and the draw up of uh, from the aqua valve into the tree and then the plants shall service themselves. That's the theory behind it. We have the reservoir, 100 litres on the side of the tent. Obviously you have to be above the pots, it uses gravity this system and uh, yeah we'll uh, be turning that on very shortly but yeah we'll have a little Closer look at these, whilst I give them some spray. Yeah, boom boom. Used it on a few girls actually when they sent it to me. And uh, chuffed, you really do notice the difference. Uh, check these, we'll give them a day or two. And we'll come back and watch, watch you see how they've exploded. Oh, I'll have to turn that right down. There we go, that's the one. That's a pink kush CBD, but yeah, you can tell here, man. They're uh, Flying up now. Loving life under the 1000 watt HPS. Two here. The picture of health. Really have sort of left them to their own devices. Um, and here on the autopots, it's, uh, I've made the mistake in the past of being a little bit too. Uh, a little bit worried about feeding them too much in the early stages, and you know the plant just doesn't have t doesn't have the right sort of time to establish itself when you're overfeeding the roots alone, and the roots become stagnant, and then you get lockout, all that sort of shit that you don't want. So you just got to let them do their thing, make sure that they've got enough to keep them going whilst they're in these very early early stages and if you do that be diligent with your feeding processes and watering processes you should be alright but as I said these have just been running off their first initial watering the soil was pretty moist anyway it's got all that natural seaweed in there and the plugs that we started the, the, uh, the seeds off in coco coil plugs and we use bio biz sorry bio green rooting x which is a rooting stimulant and uh, it promotes all the good root, uh, root hair growth and helps with a good development of the root system but yeah this is a quick one, super quick happy days, boom boom spray applied and we'll, uh, we'll check back maybe in a couple of days just to see what, we, what we're seeing with the boom 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 Exodus cheese in my room. 
Take it easy, everyone. Have a good one.